Hey, what's going on everyone? You're watching The Collectors Hut. My name's Chris and I'm going to be reviewing my EFX Darth Vader helmet from A New Hope. I mean, this helmet is where it's at. It's as real as it's going to get of having a piece of Vader in your own home. I mean, they absolutely nailed it. Um, EFX puts out amazing products and they spared no expense on this one. I mean, if you don't mind spending a pretty penny, like definitely pick one up. I love having it and I do not regret anything. Love it all day long. I mean, this helmet is, I mean, size, color, you know, they use different paints to shadow it. Uh, I mean, the lenses are red. It, it's just overall breathtaking. It really is. So I'm going to spin it around so you guys can get a, a better look at it. This is the limited edition series and there was only a thousand of them made. This is uh, 452. Um, this padding on the inside, so, I mean, it makes wearing it a lot more enjoyable because it's very comfortable. Um, like I said, I, I mean, I really can't say much more. I mean, the helmet speaks for itself. It's just so awesome. I mean, it's it's really big. Um, it's big on me, but I'm 5'7". I'm kind of a small guy. I mean, David Prowse is a big dude. I mean, it fits him perfectly, but on me, it's pretty funny, which you will be seeing soon. Um, I kind of look like a bobblehead, but it's uh, awesome. It's a lot of fun wearing it. You feel like Vader when it's on. I met David Prowse a couple of times. Wicked nice guy. He will sign anything you want and write any of his lines on there. I got this picture signed. Um, this was from Empire Strikes Back, and I love the fact that he signed it in gold. It makes it pop more. The fact that he wrote David Prowse is Darth Vader is pretty cool. I got this, I picked this picture up, don't know where, um, but I got him to sign it. And it was funny because he thought I drew this and I'm not an artist by no means. I did not draw this, I bought this. And he wrote, to Chris, join the dark side. So that's pretty cool, you know. This is a super, super cool photo. I love it. The fact that he signed it towards me asking me jo to join the dark side. Would I? I would not join the dark side. But if he was like right in front of me like, join the dark side, I, I would be like, damn. I, I guess I would have to. But I, I don't want to. So I also picked this figure up. This was celebrating the 25 years of Star Wars, A New Hope back in 1977 to 2002. This was exclusive to New York Toy Fair, which I did not attend, I bought this. But I just love this figure so much. The lightsaber protrudes out of uh, the bubble shell there. I mean, it's awesome. And I got him to sign the top corner, which I have a picture of and I will be showing you that. I mean, this figure is probably one of my favorites, besides for the first Darth Vader with removable helmet, which just blew everybody's mind. So, this figure is super cool. I, I mean, he looks like he's metallic, but I'm pretty sure it's plastic, but they did an awesome job with this. I mean, if you guys see it, it's pretty rare. If you see it, pick it up. Uh, it's, it's great. It's a great, great figure. So, these are the pictures with me with David Prowse. Actually, the figure that he signed and the picture that he signed. Everybody that I get autographs from, I meet in person. I go to a lot of conventions, and uh, I like when they make it out to me. It's it's just makes it a lot better. I forgot to tell you about this little booklet that came with this amazing helmet from EFX. Um, basically just, it has some literature in it, it has some awesome pictures, some concept art, and um, you know, some pictures of the mold and the making it. Just basically, basically saying that it's the real deal. I love that picture, that picture's awesome. 
So, I mean, they really did spare no expense with this helmet. It's pretty incredible. Um, the way that it was shipped, it had, like, tons of padding around it. Uh, it was, like, impossible for it to get damaged. I mean, they just take great pride in their work, and I'm super happy and thankful for that. So this is the moment we've all been waiting for. I'm going to put this helmet on. It does have some weight to it. It's made out of like a fiberglass material. Um, very smooth on the outside, a little rough on the inside. The mask, like I said, is padded on the inside. So this is overall wicked comfortable. If you have a bigger head, there's adjustment straps and stuff like that. The lenses are red. I hope you can see that. It's like that scene from Revenge of the Sith when it's getting load on Anakin's face. That's exactly what it feels like every time I put this on. So yeah, I got totally carried away with that. Um, you know what, something that you want to, like right when you put it on, you want to be like, you're part of a Rebel Alliance or a traitor, now take her away. You put this helmet on, you feel like Vader. Like I said, worth every penny. I mean, you guys, honestly, if you don't have one, you got to pick one up. Um, there's some kind of like, it feels like almost like a magnet when you put it back on because it like sucks in. So, I mean, they really thought of every single little detail, and I can't say it enough how awesome this is. So, I really hope you guys liked it. I hope I did a decent review for you guys. Um, I know other people have reviews on this helmet, but I, I want you to see me wear it, spin it around, talk about it a little bit. Um, just from a, like a regular guy's point of view. Um, not saying that the other people aren't regular guys, but I'm just saying... I just want to have fun with it. Um, so this is the Collector's Hut. I'm Chris. The next episode, I'm going to have one of my buddies over. I'm going to put some Star Wars masks on them from some familiar faces that you guys are going to love. So make sure you tune into that. And just thank you, like, for everything, all the support, all the feedback. I really appreciate it, and I really hope you guys are enjoying this because I'm having a blast with it, as you can see. So, uh, thanks guys so much. Once again, this is the Collector's Hut. My name's Chris, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.